New Shooter coverage of Cine Gear 2025 is sponsored by B&H Build Expo, June 17th and 18th at the Javits Center, New York, and Atlas Lensco. Hi, it's Matt here for NewShooter.com at Cine Gear 2025. I'm with Henry from Band Pro now. Uh, I want you to know Optimo Primes. Uh, these have sort of been designed so that people can tune them without having to do anything permanently and today at the show here you're announcing a new iris. That's correct, yeah. So uh, for those who don't know, the Optimo Primes are designed to be uh, manipulated. So there's uh, three levels essentially you have. Uh, the first being what we call the IOP, the internal optical palette. Uh, essentially it's a filter that sits right here in this red ring, kind of right in the middle of the lens. Um, behind that you have your iris, which is actually a cartridge, so it's removable. Uh, the stock lens is a nine blade iris, but as you mentioned this year, we're announcing the oval iris. Um, and then we have a three blade iris. Um, behind that is the rear, is the last and final stage of um, tweaking. And so there you have another slot to put uh, real fil rear filtration. Um, and we have a few different flavors of uh, looks, but today we're kind of showing the extremes, if you will, of what we can do with the lenses. Um, but yeah, so we have an oval and then a three blade here. Uh, so the oval will give you that sort of anamorphic looking bokeh and with the three blade iris, obviously you're getting more of something like a Zeiss Super Speed. That's exactly it, yeah. And then from there, uh, like I said, we have um, in this one, a soft blue IOP. So that's kind of uh, developing right where the image uh, aligns in the middle of the lens. And then in the rear, we have a black pro mist. Um, so all those are Tiffin filters, which is great. We've worked with them and they're helping design all the IOPs. Um, and then on the oval, we have an antique black pearlescent and then a low con in the rear to kind of give a more vintage feel with it. And these are all things that can be user interchanged. That's correct. Yeah. So there's a toolkit that comes with the lenses um, and that is uh, allows you to go right through the front. So there's uh, special tools to get you all the way down through uh, to the iris and then you essentially just build your way back up. So in terms of um, pricing and availability, are these uh, new irises available yet? or They are uh, going to be coming in the next couple months. We are doing some final testing, but um, we're really excited about them. And um, we're just here today to show everyone that they are finally coming out. Uh, it's been something we've been talking about a while. The uh, technology to design the blades and get them perfect, to be able to align and open and close. And um, there's obviously a T-stop change that happens with that. So actually, when you get the new iris cartridge, uh, the lens, uh, which normally starts, most of them are T1.8, you go to a T2.6. Obviously because of the oval shape, you lose a little bit of light there. Um, so now that all that's coming together, we're just excited to show it to everybody. So I mean, a I guess the great thing with the Optimo Primes is that they're, they're very unique in this way that, you know, they're user tunable yep. and you don't have to start from something and then, you know, normally with lens tuning, it's a permanent thing. So this one is, you know, project by project, you can have a set of lenses that you can change things over. That's exactly it. You can come up with your own custom look. Um, you can uh, obviously manipulate as far as extreme you want to go or just as little bit. And you're, since you're using filters that we all work with, Black Promise, Black Satin, Glimmer Glass, um, you already kind of have a basis for what manipulations are happening to the lens. And then stock, the lenses are part of the Optimo family, so they're going to mix in with the Ultra Compacts or the 12.5. So um, kind of whichever direction you need to go, you kind of can with these lenses.